Hi friends, welcome back to my channel and a very special welcome if you're new here. My name is Jen, I'm a certified weight loss and nutrition coach and I'm on WW Personal Points. Happy Sunday, it is the beginning of July, so today I am coming at you with my June favorites. I have everything from WW Foods, kitchen goodies, jewelry, makeup, skincare. I have everything for you that I have been loving for the month of June. So if you're excited for another favorites video, give this one a big, huge thumbs up. Make sure you're subscribed and your bell notification is turned on because I upload five videos a week and I even do a favorites video every single month. Check out the description box down below where I will list everything that I shared with you in today's video. You'll also find nutrition coaching where I offer personalized to you macros and calories highly, highly recommend, as well as one-on-one -on -one coaching if you would like to chat with me directly. Links and discounts to all of my other favorite things and, of course, my Facebook group. Definitely come on over. Join us there. We would love to have you. So let's go ahead and jump in to my June favorites. I'm going to start with my WW food favorites. I actually discovered quite a few new foods that I am loving this last month. The first one we're going to start with is gone. It's empty because I ate them all because these are incredible. I actually picked these up from Nutrition. I saw them on their website. I thought, ooh, those sound really good. I love a good baked puff with some white cheddar. These are the Vienna chickpea snacks. And one of the reasons besides how delicious they sounded that I chose these is they have five grams of plant protein per serving and only six net carbs. There are 160 calories for one ounce. There's three servings in the bag, so you actually get a lot of them for the serving size, and they are crunchy and white cheddar-y. They are so incredibly good. I've actually seen these on Imperfect Foods as well, and when I went to place my order, they were on the website, so I added them to my cart. I will link Nutrition and Imperfect Foods down below for you. There is $40 worth of free groceries when you join Imperfect Foods. I don't know if you can find these in your local store. I have always just picked them up when I do my online orders, but they are really delicious. And in the event that you follow more of a keto approach, these are now keto friendly. So I highly recommend absolutely, absolutely yummy. Next is a fiber supplement. I actually share this in a what I eat in a day because I have truly, truly fallen in love with this product. This is the Just Better Fiber Supplement. Now, whether you suffer from constipation issues or whether you don't get enough fiber in your diet or both, this is just a great supplement to add to your diet. I actually put one to two tablespoons of this in my coffee every morning. It dissolves absolutely beautifully in cold liquid and hot liquid. It's just a really, really good way to get in your fiber. There is 10 calories per tablespoon. It is zero points. On the bottom here, it says it's non-GMO, vegan, gluten and wheat free, egg free, soy free, nothing artificial, and it's even food map friendly. It's a nice, clean dietary supplement for fiber. And what I love about it is it does not bloat me. All of the fiber supplements that I've tried in the store make me extremely bloated. This one does not, and it 100% does its job. It is just such a great product. It is a small business, which you know I love supporting. And if you really are looking for a beneficial fiber supplement, get the Just Better Fiber. It is a 10 out of 10. Speaking of supplements, there is a new protein supplement that I've added to my routine. In my protein video, I'll link that down below if you missed it, where I shared my favorite foods to get in my protein every day. I shared the Iso Pure protein powder that you can add to water. I love that water enhancer. It has 20 grams of protein, 90 calories. It tastes really, really good, but it can be a little bit on the pricey side. So I actually had somebody in my Facebook group, and if you're watching, thank you for posting this, post about this protein supplement on Amazon. This is from the company Muscle Tech, and this is the ISO Way Clear Ultra Pure Protein Isolate. I grabbed the flavor Orange Dream Sickle. It is so good. It tastes like you're eating a melted orange dreamsicle ice cream. It is so good. It is a more affordable than the Isopure brand, and it still has the 90 calories. It still has 90 calories, but this one actually has 22 grams of protein, zero grams of fat, and only one carb. This is so good. Now, I love the Isopure, and I love this one too. So if you are a little bit more on a budget and you want to include some protein supplements to help you reach your protein goal. This one, like I said, is more affordable than the Isopure and it is 
absolutely delicious. I will definitely, definitely be buying all of the flavors to try them out. Next are these little baby bells. I had never tried the baby bell Gouda cheeses and these were on a really good sale at my local fries, which is a Kroger store. So I picked up a bag. These are so good. Literally where have these been all my life? They are so good. They're so much better than the regular baby bell. So if you can find the little Gouda ones, highly recommend. Another supplement I've been loving that I actually shared in a what I eat in a day is this finish line from 6 a.m. run. I have the flavor watermelon. As I've shared with you guys, my workout routine is pretty intense. And when I lift weights, I get extremely sore. So I was asking for supplement recommendations to help with soreness from my coach and she recommended the 6 a.m. run finish line. Not only does this taste absolutely incredible, it helps with soreness exponentially. I drink this when I return home from the gym. I mix it with some water and like I said, it tastes really good. It kind of gives that watermelon Jolly Rancher taste, but what I love about it is it helps my muscle recovery so much and it helps with the soreness. I find that instead of being sore for several days after my workout, I'm pretty good the next day if I incorporate this after my workout. There's 50 servings in the container, so it's really affordable per serving. And if you suffer from soreness or achy muscles, this is something you absolutely need to pick up. Let's talk about a little sweet treat that has captured my heart. I actually bought these also from Imperfect Foods. These are the skinny dipped almonds and strawberry lemonade. These are so incredibly delicious. The almond is super crunchy, but that strawberry lemonade coating, it just melts in your mouth and the flavor is on point. I mean, these are so, so good. They're 140 calories for one ounce, which is about 16 almonds. That's a good amount for a dessert. They're satisfying because they have the healthy fat of the almond. They are so, so good. I have never seen these in my stores. So let me know if you find these locally, but they're generally on Imperfect Foods. If you subscribe or you want to subscribe to that box, they generally have these available. 10 out of 10. Another one of my favorite things are these organic brown rice cakes from Sprouts. Now I'm sure that there are other brands that have a rice cake similar to this. This is the light, lightly salted and sometimes I buy the unsalted. But what I like about these is the size of the rice cake. So most rice cakes are 60, 70 calories. These ones are only 25 calories and they are the perfect size for a tablespoon of nut butter. You know, one of my favorite snacks is a tablespoon of my American Dream nut butter on a rice cake. And I just really like the size of these. They're crunchy. They have a really good flavor. They're cheap, super cheap. I think it's $1.29 for the stack of them. And just the size of them is perfect for what I like a good peanut butter rice cake for. And like I said, I'm sure there's other brands that have this same size, but look for ones that are about 20 to 25 calories. They're the perfect size for a tablespoon of nut butter. I also wanna share with you this protein shake that I recently picked up from my very first little trip to Sam's Club. This is from the Fairlife brand, but this is the Core Power Elite in chocolate. This protein shake has 42 grams of protein. 42. There's 230 calories in the bottle. So it's about 100, 90 to 100 calories more than the traditional Fairlife shake. But instead of 30 grams of protein, there's 42. They taste really, really good, especially in coffee. And what I've been using these for is days that I work out. So days that I'm strength training and doing the elliptical because that's a heavy workout for me. And I feel like I really need to recover with more protein or on days that I just don't have time to eat breakfast. So I need to sustain myself from my coffee to a morning snack or even until lunch. These come in really handy. They're thick, they're creamy, kind of like chocolate milk, and they have 42 grams of protein. You cannot go wrong. I'm sure you can buy these on Amazon. If I can find them on Amazon, I'll link them down below for you. And like I said, I found these at my local Sam's Club and I've truly fallen in love with them. They are just a great way to get in a lot of protein. Speaking of protein, this is another thing I've been loving and these are the Quest Frosted Cookies. These are so, so, so good. They truly remind me of those loft house cookies that you can buy in the bakery. You know, the ones that are really soft with all the frosting on top. That is completely the vibe that these give to me. This is the size of the cookie. They have five grams of protein, one net carb, and they're only 90 calories. They're so soft. They're frosted. They're really good. Now the Quest bars bother my stomach, but the cookies don't. And I don't know if there's less sugar alcohols maybe. This one says that there's only six grams of sugar alcohol. So that's probably why it doesn't bother my 
stomach as much, but these are really, really good. They're a great sweet treat if you're craving a cookie or if you're just wanting something sweet and it's a great way to get in five grams of protein with a dessert. I bought mine by the box off of Nutrition, and again, that Nutrition will be linked down below for you. I've never seen these in my stores, either singly or by the box. If you know where you can pick these up in a local store, let us know down in the comments. And last but not least for WW Food Favorites is another item I purchased off of Nutrition. You know my love for Fiber Gourmet Pasta and I buy that on Nutrition. And I saw that the Fiber Gourmet brand had biscotti bites and I picked up a couple flavors, the original and the ginger spice. I love the ginger spice. It says 41% less calories than compared to other biscotti. So there's 80 calories, 10 grams of fiber, 13 net carbs, and three grams of protein per serving. And a serving is 12 crackers for the 80 calories. They are crunchy, they're sweet. The ginger in these is so good. It gives me that ginger pumpkin spice flavor. They have little sliced almonds in them, so you're getting the crunch from the nuts. They're just really good, and they're a great way to get in 10 grams of fiber. If you didn't know, as a woman, we should shoot for 20 to 25 grams a day. So if I can get 10 grams of fiber in a sweet treat and a crunchy cracker, I'm definitely interested. home favorites that I want to share with you. One of them I've been sharing nonstop in my Facebook group, on Instagram, on YouTube, and that is my water bottle from Lululemon. I made my very first trip to Lululemon when I went to San Diego, fell in love with the store, fell in love with their workout clothing, but most importantly, fell in love with this water bottle. I don't know what voodoo magic is in this water bottle, but not only does it keep your water super cold, I can have ice in this bottle for days, but there is something about this bottle, how it's made, whatever is in this silver lining that actually makes your water taste better. Myself, my best friend Rachel, and our friend Kelly all bought this bottle. We all say the same thing. The water tastes the absolute best we've ever had in this bottle. It's $48, which is on par with the Hydro Flask, the Hydro Jug, some of those other more expensive water bottles but this is literally the best one that I've ever had. In fact, this is the only water bottle that I even reach for now. I carry it with me everywhere. Get this bottle, get it, get it, get it. If you struggle to get in your water, it's going to taste so good, you're going to wanna get in your water. And like I said, it's great for on the go and it keeps your water super, super cold. I did buy this cute little uh, water bottle kind of sticker pack off of Amazon. I'll link it down below too if you're interested. I fell in love with it because it has the cactus in it and then this is my favorite one. It says, no problema. They're just some fun stickers just to personalize the water bottle. Get the water bottle. If it's the last thing you do, get the water bottle. The other home favorite that I wanna share with you is actually my Ninja Creamy. I finally bit the bullet and picked up the Ninja Creamy. There was a post in my Facebook group where people were just raving about it and how you can make healthy, low calorie, low point protein ice cream in the Ninja Creamy and I was sold. I'm going to link it down below on the Bed Bath & Beyond site. That is the cheapest place to get it because you can utilize their 20% off coupon. I've been in love with this. I have been making ice cream pretty much every single night for both Troy and myself. I have found some really, really good protein ice cream recipes. So not only do I get ice cream, but I get an entire pint of ice cream for about 200 calories. I also can get in 20 to 30 grams of protein. I shared a few of my favorite recipes in this last week's, in this last Wednesday's What I Eat in a Day. I'll link that video down below for you, but I love the Ninja Creamy. It has been such a great investment. I think out of all my kitchen appliances, which I have a lot of them, I have gotten the most use out of this. And since we're moving into summer, it couldn't come at a better time. If you love ice cream, if you want a healthier alternative to ice cream, it's super fun to come up with recipes. I mean, there are Facebook groups dedicated to this Ninja Creamy, pick it up. And like I said, Bed Bath & Beyond with the 20% discount is going to be the most affordable. I am truly in love with it. there's one jewelry favorite that I want to share with you and that's actually the necklace that I'm wearing today. This is from the brand Fossil. 
Did you know Fossil had jewelry? Because I didn't. And I actually saw someone on Instagram wearing this necklace and she linked it and I was like, I have to have it. So I immediately ran over to the Fossil website and picked it up. It is beautiful, it is gold, and it has these really pretty kind of pinky colored hearts. They're kind of a rose gold colored heart. And it's the perfect choker style necklace. It has two different length options where you can make it shorter or a little bit longer. It's a great layering necklace. And I just think that it elevates really any outfit. I mean, I'm wearing a tank top and look how cute this necklace looks with it. I mean, it can go, it's great for the office, for weddings that are coming up, for everyday wear. I just really love it. And the quality is so good. When I bought mine, it was 50% off on the Fossil website. I'll link it down below for you. If it's still 50% off or on sale, I'll note that as well for you. But if you're looking for just a really versatile, beautiful, high quality piece, definitely grab this one from Fossil. jump into my beauty favorites. Everything from makeup, perfume, skincare, and of course we're going to start with perfume. If you watch my favorites videos, or really if you follow me in general, you know my obsession with Dossier perfume. I love perfume. I wear perfume every day. In fact, fun fact about me, I put perfume on before bed because I just want to smell good when I go to bed. And I have fallen in love with Dossier. They are a replicating company, so they replicate high-end perfumes for an affordable price. Their perfumes are anywhere from $29 to $39 without any discounts. I will link Dossier down below for you with a 10% discount. They are always running promotions on their website and I would imagine with the 4th of July weekend there's some type of discount. And what's great is the discount down in the description box, you can piggyback with any discount on the website. So you can double dip your discounts. Every month or so I like to pick up a couple of new fragrances for myself because this is my go-to perfume. This is the perfume that I wear every single day and I have a hard time buying high-end perfumes. I have a hard time spending well over $100 dollars on a perfume and since finding dossier I know that I can replicate those high-end fragrances for a much more affordable price and honestly these smell exactly the same so in the month of June the two fragrances that I picked up was the floral grapefruit every fragrance comes with a little card that talks to you about the notes what perfume it's inspired by and basically how to use the dossier perfume so this one is inspired by one of my favorite high-end perfumes and that is the Chanel Chanka A Oh, Tantra Eau de Perfume. Oh my gosh, I probably just butchered that. But I have been smelling this all, I smell this all the time in the store and I really, really love the fragrance, but we know how expensive Chanel is. So when I saw that Dossier replicated that, I instantly picked it up. The notes in this one are going to be top notes of grapefruit, pear, and black currant. So it's fresh and fruity for summer. Your middle notes are hyacinth, jasmine, and lilac, and your base notes are orris, muska, and amberwood. So it's that fruity, fresh smell with some base notes of musk, which just really balance out the fragrance. Oh. It is, it literally, literally smells like the Chanel perfume. I, I can't get over how this replicates that to a T. It is the perfect summer fragrance. It gives you the perfume vibe with that sweetness of all of those fruits that are in here. I really, really love the floral grapefruit. And one thing too I wanna point out about Dossier is all of their lids are magnetic. So you can throw these in your purse and the lid doesn't fall off, which I always have at least one, sometimes two Dossier fragrances in my purse, but I have been really loving the floral grapefruit. The second fragrance that I picked up for June was the floral lavender, and this is inspired by YSL, which is another really, really crazy expensive brand. This is their Libra OD Perfume. This is another brand that I kind of lust over when I smell it in store because it smells incredible. Your notes in this one, your top notes are Mandarin, Neroli, and Black current. You can see that I'm loving the more fruity vibe for summer. Your middle notes are jasmine, lavender, and orange blossom. I really love the orange blossom in here. And your base notes are vanilla, amber, and musk. So again, another kind of fruity smelling with a back note of musk. Oh, it's YSL. It's YSL for under $40. I mean, you can't beat it. I don't have any perfume on yet today, so... So floral lavender, it is, I love this. Oh my gosh, 
I have to say, I smell pretty incredible. Again, I'll link Dossier down below for you with 10% off. Don't forget to pair that with any other discount on their website. If you love perfume as much as I do, but you don't love expensive prices, this is going to be your new favorite perfume company. I have one skincare favorite for you, and this is, this is just about gone. I mean, I'm down to about here in the bottle. I have really been loving this. This is from the brand Good Molecules, and this is their Niacinamide Brightening Toner. I love, love, love toner. For me, toner just sets my face up with a nice foundation for my other skincare products. And this one, because it has niacinamide in it, it's very hydrating, but it's also glowy, which I love. I will use this on no makeup days just to add that really pretty glow to my skin. And like I said, this is almost gone. I've been using it every single day. And Good Molecules for the quality is really, really affordable. Highly recommend this if you're looking for a good hydrating glowy toner. I have a few makeup favorites to share with you, starting with this gloss. This gloss from NYX is my all-time favorite gloss, and this is an affordable drugstore gloss. This is new to the NYX line, and this is the This Is Milky Gloss. I have a ton of shades of this gloss. This is actually the gloss that I have on today. It is beautiful by itself. It's beautiful to layer over a liquid lipstick. We know that they can be a little bit drying, so this will just add that hydration. It's such a great formula. There is no need, no need to spend a lot of money on glosses because drugstore brands kill it. And the NYX This Is Milky Gloss is my all-time favorite. Speaking of drugstore brands, I have to share with you this loose powder. This is from the brand Maybelline, and this is their Fit Me Loose Powder. I have mine in the shade Light Medium. So this is a tinted powder. They also have it in translucent if you prefer that. But this powder is so good. The minute I apply this to my face, not only does it set all of my makeup in place, it lasts all day and it just makes my face look flawless, like filter flawless. It's under $10. And I mean, mine's almost gone. I maybe have like two or three more uses, but I've been using this for a couple of months. Again, no need to spend a lot of money on powder. The Maybelline Fit Me is the honestly one of the best powders I've tried. There is a higher end product that I wanna share with you that I've been loving for summer, and that is the Charlotte Tilbury Flawless Filter. I've been using this on days that I don't wear makeup or on days that I want that no makeup makeup look. This, is, this can be used as a primer under makeup, or it can be used as just a dewy, base or it can be used on its own. It adds a really pretty dewy hydrated look to the skin, a little bit of a glow from within look. I really, really love this all on its own. I have used it under my makeup, but my go-to for this is on its own. It does add a little bit of tint, a little bit of color to the skin, and it literally makes you look dewy and fresh. I reach for this. It's not super expensive. It is a little bit more expensive than drugstore, but a little bit goes a long way. I really, really love this. If you're not into a lot of makeup, this would be a go-to product for you. I've also shared on my beauty channel. If you don't subscribe to my beauty channel, I'll link it down below for you. I do lots and lots of makeup tutorials. I get lots of questions on how I do my makeup. Follow me on my beauty channel because there are lots and lots of tutorials. I've shared on there that I really have been loving cream products, especially as I'm getting older. I find that they just sit a lot better on the skin. So I wanna share with you a brand new product from ColourPop, which is a super affordable brand. This is in the shade Windmill, and this is a putty highlight. So basically it feels like putty. For me, it's a little bit too deep as a highlight, but it is a beautiful luminous cream blush. I mean, it is so, so pretty. It actually serves the purpose of both a highlighter and a blush. It's actually what I have on my cheeks today. It just adds a really pretty glow and a little bit of color. So you don't need to buy a highlighter and a blush. You can just pick this one up. It's under $10 and I really, really love the formula. There's a couple other colors in the new ColourPop line. This is from the in the Springs collection, their Palm Springs collection, that are really just highlighter colors. But I like this one because it's a blush and a highlight. Speaking of blush, this little cream blush from Fenty Beauty has been my go-to cream blush for summer. It's a really pretty kind of bright orange coral shade. Again, this is the blush that I have on today. This is in the shade Peach Face, and it is a cream product. So it is a cream blush, and like I said, it just does really, really good on older skin. It just doesn't settle into fine lines and wrinkles. I mean, look at those two together. You could use the cream blush and then top it with that windmill shade from ColourPop. 
absolutely beautiful. I've been loving corals and oranges and fun, bright colors of makeup for summer. And this has been the cream blush I've been reaching for the most. And last but not least for beauty, we always end out my beauty favorites with my favorite palette. And since and since we are in summer, it has to go to ColourPop Barbie palette. This actually came out last year on the ColourPop website in collaboration with Barbie. And this is the palette that I go to for fun summer looks. It's definitely a bright, colorful summer palette, but you can see that there's some neutral shades as well. So if you don't love color, but you love neutral, this is a really great palette. Super affordable as ColourPop is. Excellent, excellent matte and shimmer formula. I mean, absolutely beautiful matte and shimmer formula. It's been my go-to palette for summer. It's been my go-to palette for June. Now, I'm pretty sure that this is still available on the ColourPop website. I'll make sure that it's linked down below for you. But if you want an affordable, kind of fun summery palette, the Barbie palette is my all-time fave. So those are all of my June favorites. Wow, we had a lot of WW foods. We had some jewelry, some home favorites, some beauty favorites, lots of good stuff for you to pick up. And like I mentioned, I'll link everything down below. I will find the most affordable price. I will link any discounts that I can round up for you down in the description box as well, along with nutrition coaching, links and discounts to my other favorite things. And of course, don't forget, follow me over on Instagram and join our Facebook group. We would love to have you. I hope you enjoyed my June favorites and I'll see you all in the next one. Bye.